All right, Shalom. Shalom, Hebrew Israelites. All right. All right. This is Officer Ezariah Ben Yosef, Hebrew Israelite. Okay. And captain of the group One Body in Ohio, live in Aiken, South Carolina. You know, I deal with scoffers all the time, people who have no faith. But like I tell people when I'm out there preaching, I, I say Hebrew Israelites are the real Christians. Christians means followers of Christ. You know, the Christian uh, people in the Christian church has gone off. All right? They're teaching lies like the commandments are done away with and stuff like that. Hebrew Israelites don't preach that. There's a lot of false doctrine in the world today. And I'm going to prove that. This is what we mean when we out there preaching the truth. This is what real Hebrew Israelites stand for. Turn with me to 1 John chapter 5. Whosoever believes that the most, um, that Yeshaya or Yahawashai, whom the world calls Jesus Christ, is the Christ, which means Savior, Yesha in Hebrew, is born of the Most High. And everyone who loves him, who begot, also loves him, who is begotten of him. So in other words, if you are a true follower of the Most High, then you will believe in Christ, okay? You got a lot of wicked people who say they love Christ and they're following Christ and they're not really following the Son of the Most High. By this, we know that we love the children of God. You must be able to recognize who are the children of God in this earth, not those Israeli not those imposters, those bastards who are occupying our homeland in Jerusalem, okay? Those are not the real Jews. It tells you that in Revelation chapter 2, verse 9, and Revelation chapter 3, verse 9. The real Jews are the children of God who are Negroes that are scattered throughout the world. And it tells you that in the book of Deuteronomy, chapter 28. So we must be able to recognize and love the people of God. When we love the Most High and keep His commandments, so we must keep His commandments. That that means we, uh, what the Christian Church preaching is a bunch of lies. The commandments are not done away with. Christ didn't say to, he, to do away with the commandments. Okay, He doesn't say that in the Book of Matthew. He said, Christ said, He uh, think not that I came to do away with the laws. You see. Because the law from Genesis to Revelation is all about Christ. Christ is the fulfillment of the commandments. When fulfillment it does not mean doing away with, it is establishing it. You see that? So Christ came to, to bring back what Moses, what the Most High established through Moses. So we are to keep his commandments. And his commandments are not burdensome. You see that? So if you love the most much, it's going back precept upon precept. The Bible interprets itself. So if you are a follower of the Most High, you wouldn't question what thus saith the Lord. See that? For whatever is born of the Most High overcomes the world. You see that? It's <coughs> lucky. For what, whatever is born, whatever is born, Whatever is born of the Most High overcomes the world. So being the child of God, I am an Israelite. See that? I am an Israelite. So I am his job, his job, and our job is to serve the Most High. See that? Salakia, pay attention now. Because this is what it's all about. During these trials and tribulations, we got to stand firm on our faith and know that we are here to serve the Most High. And you cannot waver on that. You see? I am a Hebrew Israelite, Hebrew by language, Israelite by nationality. That is our heritage. And as it tells us in Jeremiah chapter 17, we will be discontinued from our heritage. Why? Because, because of the curses. Because our forefathers and foremothers, our ancestors, broke the laws, statutes, and commandments. So don't tell me the laws are done away with. It's not. It explains why we are in the condition we are today. See that? 
and this is the victory that has overcome the world is our faith that's what we mean by we say we're the truth we're about what the most thus saith the lord and we operate and serve the most high with faith who is he who overcomes the world but he who believes that the most high i mean that yeshaya or yahawashai is the son or people call him yeshua that christ is the son of god so we must believe in christ there's no getting around it the bible tells us there's christ himself says there's no good getting to the father but by through him Right? So you must have that one understanding and be on one accord. All right? Stand firm, brothers. Okay? Don't give up this truth and keep preaching this word with sincerity and truth. Quam Rashriella! Quam Rashriella!